Montana. The name conjures up thoughts of the old rugged west, of unspoiled scenery and wildlife, of unforgettable vistas and mountain ranges. In northwest Montana, on the shores of Flathead Lake, the Averill family has shown guests and families what true western hospitality is all about for over 60 years. Averill's Flathead Lake Lodge is a family-operated dude ranch featuring memorable western vacations for the entire family where horses and hospitality are a genuine way of life. Started in 1945 by Les Averill as a dude ranch and hunting lodge, the ranch is now operated by his son Doug, his wife Maureen, and their three children. For over 60 years, the Averill family and their exceptional staff have created an unforgettable Western family vacation, offering an unparalleled selection of recreational activities, creating a lifetime of memories for their guests. We're at the Averill Ranch in Northwest Montana. It's a historic dude ranch that's located on Flathead Lake. Flathead Lake's the largest natural lake west of the Great Lakes. And in our front yard, uh, we enjoy the lake. And in our backyard, uh, we have riding country that goes up into the mountains and overlooks Glacier Park and Jewel Basin primitive area. And also the Bob Marshall Wilderness, which is the nation's largest wilderness area. And trail rides uh, go up every day, starting early in the morning. We leave about seven o'clock in the morning and have breakfast rides and, and wander up through the, uh, the game preserve where we see large elk and buffalo and uh, views of the lake and, and return about two o'clock every day. And then in the evening we'll take dinner rides and go up and uh, have a dinner on the mountain and wander back about dark and make for some beautiful riding. Uh, it's rough mountain country, lots of uh, uh, rocky mountain country with big pine trees and open vistas and uh, beautiful country at about 3,000 feet elevation and uh, daytime temperatures in the uh, mid 80s. It's, it's quite beautiful for horseback riding. Horseback riding, and lots of it, is a specialty of the ranch. But the ranch also offers what may be the widest selection of guest activities available, especially when it comes to water sports and other activities. After a morning trail ride in the mountains, guests can take in a day of sailing fishing, water skiing, white water rafting, Arts and crafts. <laughs> Tennis. Volleyball. Canoe and kayaking. Or just enjoy a lazy afternoon of swimming with friends and family. Uh, 
Uh, Flathead Lake Lodge is a historic ranch going back to 1945. My father started the ranch at that time following World War II and uh, some of his first guests were Bugsy Siegel and Virginia Hill that were starting Las Vegas and I'm uh, not sure that some of our guests today aren't their ancestors but uh, uh, early on the, the gangsters uh, helped fund the place and get it going and, and, uh, and they hid out at the ranch and uh, after World War II many of the uh, politicians and military people and Hollywood people were were playing together so they would come to Montana and go hunting and fishing and that was the early start of the ranch and even today 60 years later many of our guests are military political in Hollywood uh, and it also attracts a, a, a very interest, interesting uh, clientele of families from all over the country. Many of the families go back 30, 40 years. Our oldest return guest is 56 consecutive years. Many families uh, uh, second, third generation uh, so it's a very special place to many people and uh, they've grown up here as kids and now they're back vacationing with their children and the furniture in the lodge is the same since 1932 and uh, not much changes around here. The trails around the ranch offer some spectacular views of the mountains and Flathead Lake. But guests will especially enjoy the horseback rides through their game preserve, where spectacular bull elk, deer, and other wildlife abound. Each day of the week features a special activity, and one of the favorites is the breakfast ride, where guests will trail ride with their horses up to a breakfast camp. tie the horses, relax and enjoy a hearty cooked breakfast around a crackling morning campfire. <laughs> you can see what we're doing here. We've got some special Montana bacon. Man, there's nothing better than Montana bacon, there's no doubt about it. Uh, the ranch offers one of the largest varieties of recreation of any uh, ranch in the country and uh, we combine the water sports with all the horses and uh, usually we start riding horses early in the morning up through uh, mid-afternoon and then it's hot in the afternoons might reach uh, mid 80s 90 degrees in Montana and uh, during that time we'll go to the waterfront and enjoy the, the sailing, water skiing, boogie boarding, uh, lots of swimming uh, we'll have people out on the rivers fly fishing. Uh, the kids go out on inner tube floats. There's beautiful rivers close by. But uh, sailing is a, is a big attraction. We have two unique old Q-class historic boats from 1928 and 29. They're Hershoff designed Q-boats that uh, we've restored over the years and they're back to original condition. And they're, they're the actual two boats that raced each other in 1929 and uh, we take those out several times daily and, and the guests enjoy breaking up and having team races and and then we also have soling sailboats which is a, an olympic class boat that uh, 27 feet and the guests can enjoy sailing those on their own many of our guests are good sailors and and many have never sailed so those that haven't we we put them in a boat and give them a shove and, and a few lessons and away they go um, families of all people of all ages uh, enjoy the property. Uh, the, there's lots of grandparents that are here that enjoy watching all the activity and, and a number of teenagers that partake in all the water recreation, the volleyball, the, the river trips and uh, we even get the teenagers on a horse occasionally. And then the little kids are all over the horses uh, as much as they can ride and uh, so there's a little bit of something for everybody.
on a clear evening in Montana. It seems like you can see forever and beyond. It may be 240,000 miles from the moon to Flathead Lake Lodge, but it's just a day's flying or driving distance from just about anywhere in North America. With all the activities available to guests, they're certain to work up a big appetite. And one of the favorite events of the week is the steak fry held in the game preserve. Now, guests have two choices to get to the cookout. Trail ride with the horses up the mountain. Or ride in style on one of the three ranch fire engines. Hey, California, here I come, gonna let the wagon roll. Well, old Broken Hand Fitzpatrick was a master of the trade. I swear in all of my days of living, I've never seen a man so mean. He could ride a horse a day right down into the ground. But a trouble was staring you in the eye, not a finer friend could be found. Let him roll. Let him Here I come, gonna let the wagon roll. Over a hot bed of glowing coals. Ranch manager we'll Kevin Barrows will cook your steak to perfection. And then some wild buck starts wearing your hair, well it ain't no fault of mine. And you'll Kevin enjoy the best walk. ranch steak Watch you've ever had. Steak. All while being serenaded by one of the finest cowboy entertainers you'll ever hear. Well, I was on my way to Buckskin. I was gonna make a cattle run. Wranglers at the ranch will make sure you enjoy your horse experience. With nearly 100 horses on the ranch, they'll match you up with the one well suited to your riding skills. Even the littlest of buckaroos will enjoy the horses at the ranch with some personal attention by the Wranglers. They'll offer riding lessons for people wanting to improve their skills. And during the week, they'll give you a chance to show your riding skills with arena riding events. The horns are black and shiny and their hot breath you could feel. A bolt of beer went through the mouth, they thundered through the sky. We saw the riders coming hard, and he heard the mournful cry. To see how team roping is done? The Wranglers and some local Montana Cowboys put on a team roping demonstration to the delight of the guests. As 
the riders loped on by him, he heard one call his name. If you want to save your soul from hell, a ride on a ray. Let cowboy change your ways today with us, you will ride. Try to get the devil's herd across the endless skies. Yeah, me, I Hi, my name is Kirsten. I'm the barn manager here at Flathead Lake Lodge, and I've been here for about eight years now. I have the responsibility of buying and selling horses for a herd of 100. Um, I also hire 10 wranglers each year to help me run the barn operation. I've seen many families come here to Flathead Lake Lodge um, with children of all ages, and they come in thinking that they're all going to run in a separate direction and not enjoy the same thing or maybe they're not going to enjoy the barn at all. But as soon as they go out on a ride together, it kind of brings them all together and you can see them all um, enjoy an activity together. There's something about riding horses that uh, a lot of people can enjoy and um, kids and parents alike can have a great time at. It's just a, an excellent family experience. One of the week's highlights, which everyone enjoys, are the weekly mouse races, where the ranch mice show their athletic skill, agility, and speed to the delight of the cheering guests. After the excitement of the mouse races, the guests can take in the popular weekly barn dance. Flathead Lake Lodge also has its own four-legged ambassadors who keep an eye on things at the ranch and make sure that guests are having the most memorable Western vacation they could possibly enjoy. Bayville Ranch has, a, has an interesting philosophy. We uh, uh, tend to cater to people that vacation all over the world, but yet when they come here, the, the philosophy is keep it simple. Um, we're very user friendly. The guests feel welcome to walk in the kitchen, uh, to be a part of the ranch. Uh, we have a high guest staff ratio. We have 70 staff to 120 guests, but yet the guests feel like they, they can partake in anything they want to do. If they want to sail the sailboat themselves or, or do something on their own, go fly fishing, whatever it might be, they can pretty much uh, take off and do it on their own without a staff member. And uh, we treat it much like our home. It, it, it is our home. We, we invite them in and, and uh, you treat them just like a house guest. And, uh, they very much appreciate that, and the guests have been coming here for many, many years, feel like it's their second home, so they treat other guests the same way, and, and it has a very unique uh, atmosphere from that respect, as do many of the dude ranches. They, they're second homes to lots of families. But uh, we don't have any rules. We don't post any signs, don't do this, don't do that. Uh, you're on your own best behavior when you're here, and, and your own good judgment, and, and uh, that seems to prevail as the best way to do things. Hi, my name is Chase Averill and this is my little brother Lane and we're here at Averill's Flat Lake Lodge today. Growing up here has been an awesome experience for me. It's, uh, you don't have much privacy but the people you get to know and kids you become friends with. Um, you know, I've met people all my life each week that uh, I've grown up with and gotten to be good friends with and keep in touch and travel and go see them where they live. and. Um, and then they come here every summer and uh, it's just been an awesome experience to get to know so many great people and kids. I think the closeness on the ranch that the people develop here, they're only here, most of them, for a week at a time. And 
they come up just one week a year. And in that week, year after year, they've developed friends that are some of their closest friends and they rely on the most. And that's something that the people here really cherish is that they can come up to a small town America in Montana and they meet these people the first time they come up and over the years they just develop such a great friendship with them that they're some of the greatest friends they have. Um, basically the, the ranch hasn't changed since I've been alive. I mean I can only remember about the last 15 years or so and I think that's the way we want to keep it hopefully. You know, in the next however many years, uh, nothing's going to change then either. I uh, would just try to keep the grass green and the horses well fed. We hope you enjoy the, the beauty of the area, but more so the, uh, the simplicity and the way that uh, families are enabled to interact with their children on vacation. In today's day and age, uh, we see less and less father-son relationships, uh, dancing with your children. Um, playing together and at the ranch we blend that all together. They, you might see them horseback riding with a grandparent or at least the grandparent meets them on the mountaintop where they've ridden a horse and, and it's all a family interaction and uh, it's one of the few places you can do that and uh, they've survived a whole week without television or video games and loved every minute of it. The Averill family. The Wranglers and staff of Flathead Lake Lodge invite you to experience the most memorable Western vacation available. Flathead Lake Lodge in Montana. Unspoiled. Unforgettable.